In this video, I'm going to try to make decals on Roblox in 2024, it's updated version. You want to go ahead and go to the Create tab on the Roblox website, and from here, you're going to be at the Creator Hub. So you want to go ahead and go down to the Creation Zone left, or the dashboard on the top, and it's going to take you to the Creation Zone no matter what. And from there, you're going to go to the right and go to the Development Items, and you want to go down to Decals. And from here, you're going to upload your asset, but if you don't have your decal yet, you want to go ahead and make it. I'm going to be using Paint.net, which is a free software to make images and stuff, which will be in the description below. It's a really awesome software, I've been using it for a very long time. Now I'm going to make this new emoji which is a time lapse of me making it and i actually think it turned out pretty good now this is an updated version like i said i have an old version of how to make decals in roblox but it's outdated because roblox changed their create page and everything and everything's been moved around and how to make stuff like badges decals games it's all been changed out with this new creator hub page so after you do that go ahead and pick upload asset you want to go ahead and pick the image in your computer files or your phone whatever you're using then you want to go ahead and name your decal and you can provide a description if you want to but no one's really going to ever see the description of your decal so it's not really worth filling out but i'm just doing it for the tutorial here i named it a happy noob emoji which is kind of like emoji you go ahead and upload that and it's going to take a couple minutes for it to process the decal until it shows up you want to go ahead and just click on it to configure it if you want to go ahead and publish this onto the creator store so other people can use your decal you can go ahead and do so in the settings here you can also change the genre if you want to but it's not really going to do anything and i didn't really know what to put this on for the genre i just left it as all go ahead and save the changes so other people can use my emoji because I just did this for the tutorial, but now other people can use it if they want to. And now I'm showing you how it looks in Relic Studio, which actually looks pretty nice. It could probably be used in GUI and it could be used in a game. It's like a little noob emoji, which is actually really, it really turned out really nice. I didn't even take that long to make it, but hope you guys found this video extremely helpful. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel and smash the like button. It really does help me out. Speaking of emojis, if you want to learn how to send and text emojis on Roblox PC, you're going to watch that one video showing them on the screen right now and the link down in the description below.